something really different and this is because this is a gothic makeup look. Also, if you don't know me, I am Eileen Roy Choudhury. I'm a beauty blogger, beauty blogger as well. So if you haven't yet subscribed to my channel, then please do. Like, it is helping my channel to grow. So as you can see that I have done this full coverage gothic makeup because goth makeup look is also a thing. Like, till now, whatever I have posted, you have seen something very natural, very common. All those, every second person is wearing that kind of makeup, but even gothic look is all the red but it is still there. So it is for those people who love gothic makeup. And also if you are loving how this is looking, then also don't forget to give me a thumbs up. So without any further ado, let's get started. Hey guys, so first let's start with the moisturizer and today I'm gonna go in with this Lakme Peach Milk Moisturizer. So this is also a good moisturizer under your makeup. Right, so next I'm gonna go in with this Lakme CC Cream because I'm going full coverage today. So now I'm gonna color correct. So I'm gonna go in with this uh, cream blush which is this Hilary Roda 23. So I'm gonna color correct under my eyes. So the reason of color correcting is um, there are certain spots in my face where I have hyperpigmentation or where I look very tired. So I'm going to conceal them because I'm going full goth and for full goth you need to have a flawless base. Now I'm going to go in with this LA Tint Compact and I'm going to lightly set like very lightly set it so that this color corrector doesn't mix with this foundation and create that orange effect so I'm gonna lightly dust it off lightly dust it off this Swiss Beauty liquid concealer in shade number four which is medium beige a slight uh, lighter than my shade prime it conceal it So after concealing that uh, color corrector, I'm gonna go in with the eyes. First with the brows, so that takes me a hell lot of time. So after those are done, you can see there's a pretty, pretty bold. First, I'm going to go in with this Shringar Kajal and put it onto my eyelids. It doesn't have to be very perfect because either way we will going to blend this out. It is very much pigmented but we are not yet there of pigments. So I'm going to go in with this Revolution Velvet Rose Palette. And from here, I'm gonna go in with this shade right on top of my eyelid. So after doing this goth uh, black shade right up to my lash line, I am gonna go in and now transition it. And I'm gonna go in with this chocolate brown shade and transition it with my lids. Now I'm going to clean those edges up again with the concealer so that it can be sharp. First swipe over here. And now I'm going to conceal the rest of the face before applying foundation because baby we need those blemishes hidden like anything. I'm gonna go in with this Maybelline Superstay 24 Hours Full Coverage Foundation in the shade 128 Warm Nude. So I'm gonna put it onto my face. Slap it in with my brush. Mm -hmm. 
so my under eyes need a little bit more coverage so i'm gonna go in with this shade called uh, 05 from the same brand swiss beauty and i'm gonna just conceal those under eyes and let it sit there for a good minute this go with the lips so i do not have a what shall i say a black lipstick which is shame but i'm gonna go in with this kajal and of course with a liner to fill my lips So while my lips are drying, I'm gonna use the same liner for my eyes. I guess our concealer is ready to blend. So let us blend her in. Now we see that under eyes are gone. So our liner on the lips are dried out. So now let us complete this with the kajal. with that black shadow to give that mattness to the lips and Jacqueline has some great black shadow so after we are done with that uh, goth kind of a look so finally I'm gonna bronze up that face and not gonna use any kind of blush this time so now I'm gonna go in with this bronzer and do a very heavy bronzing so after we are done bronzing up that face gonna do a bit of a nose contouring so for mascara I'm gonna go in with this better than sex Too Faced mascara and go to those lashes So do I want to put lashes? I don't know. I mean this will look bomb but uh, okay fine let's give this a try. Hey guys so this is the final look and as you can see I've done a bit of a piercing over here, here, here as well. And if you're loving how this is looking then don't forget to share it with your friends. And I'll meet you guys in the next video. Bye guys.